I've been thinking a lot about my early childhood. I was born in Glasgow in 1977 and my mother um, gave me up for care, put me into a children's home when I was a really, really small boy. Before I was uh, put into care, we lived in a place called Barhead and another place called South Knits Hill, which were slums of Glasgow. And I remember my bedroom window being um, broken, having no glass in the window and the weeds growing up into the window. Um, and I'm one of the lucky few who was put into care and um, adopted by an amazing family and given an amazing opportunity to grow um, into the person I am today. Uh, I was really encouraged with uh, the arts. My father and my mother gave me everything uh, I needed to succeed in the arts and pushed me to do my painting and, you know, go ahead and, and, and be creative and be expressive. A lot of people know my work um, because I do the sort of very colourful, surreal, dream-like, LSD-like portraits. Um, and I'm taking a step back from that now and I'm trying to do something uh, with painting rather than digital that's reflective of my youth, of me, of where I've come from. Um, and this is the first of a series that I'm going to look at. It's a photograph that I'm copying by Nick Hedges, the amazing documentary photographer, and I hope you guys enjoy it. I am two months into this painting, um, and I've probably got about another three weeks of work left to complete it. Um, what's inspired me to paint this and to um, do a series was through the process of writing. Um, I'm working with my partner um, David on a feature film and in the process of having that um, produced um, we're looking at another year before we can get that going and um, I really wanted a visual to uh, push out uh, through my writing process and this is what came about um, because I'm writing about my past and my youth um, I wanted to go there with a visual and um, yeah this is what's come out